This was the scene Monday night as the sounds of gunshots, flashbangs, and officers pleading with 58-year-old David Parker over Bullhorn filled the air as a standoff neared its 15th hour. Law Director John Spahn described Parker as a reclusive individual with a violent history of strange behavior. That behavior would become even more bizarre as the standoff dragged on. Early Monday morning, a Columbia Gas employee arrived at Parker's home at 36 Randall Road to service his gas lines. 911 dispatchers say the worker was greeted by an irate Parker who threatened him with an assault rifle. Police arrived at the home and shortly after, SWAT was contacted when Parker refused to come out and began shooting at police. Neighbors were evacuated and local schools put on soft lockdowns. Neighbor Debbie Caudill says David was always nice to her, but she heard others had issues with him. Dave was, I mean, he was always nice to me, always. You know, I never had a problem with him, but, um, you know, other people did. But, and I'm not sure why. I don't, I'm, you know, I, just, I stayed to myself. I didn't neighbor around with the rest of them too much. I just didn't. So, but, I mean, like I said, he was always nice to me. Um, my son, he was always nice to him, you know, helpful. And, I never had a problem with it. Barricaded inside his home, David answered continued requests to exit the house with gunfire well into the night. Spawn says the accomplished survivalist disarmed a robot SWAT sent in, punctured the shield of an armored truck with ammunition, and, quote, seemed determined to kill police. Shortly after 11 a.m. Tuesday morning, nearly 27 hours after the standoff began, Parker was shot and killed by a sniper. There's no question this individual was intending to kill police officers. So the question is, how do we get him out? Then he initiated shooting at the officers and shortly after, immediately, almost immediately after that, he was shot. There was great reluctance to have this occur. We weren't going to force the issue. He ultimately decided to do that.